face value. Hey friends, today we will learn about place value. It is simple. Let's imagine a number living in a house with two rooms, tens and ones. Now if we see number 29, we know that 20 and 9 make 29. Or we can say 2 tens and 9 ones make 29. If we have to arrange 29 in the number house and only one digit can go in the one room, then 2 will go in tens room and 9 will go in ones room. Now, 29 is set in number house. Now see how to decide place value. The number in the tens place always needs one company. It needs a friend and zero is the best friend. So, zero is added to the number to describe its place value. But the number in the ones place is the leader. So its place value is written as it is. So in number 29, place value of 2 is 20 and place value of 9 is 9. Oh, I learned a trick to describe the place value. First arrange the numbers in number house. Then, if the number is in tens place, then zero is written with it to describe the place value. And, the number is in ones place, then it is written as it is. Let's see some place value for the marked digits. In 26, place value of 2 is 20. In 32, place value of 2 is 2. In 41, place value of 4 is 40. In 18, place value of 8 is 8. In 20, place value of 0 is 0. In 43, place value of 4 is 40. In 50, place value of 0 is 0. Now we will see abacus. Let's compare it. With our number house. It has two rods. One is tens and the other is ones. The beads that each row is having that decides the number shown by the abacus. Let's see how. Three tens and four ones. So the number is 34 1 10 and 3 ones so the number is 13 0 10 and 3 ones so the number is 3 3 tens and 3 ones so the number is 33 4 tens and 0 1 so the number is 40. 3 tens and 5 ones. The number is 35. 2 tens and 3 ones. The number is 23. I have made my own abacus. You also make and have fun with numbers.